Alright, back up, and we have completely the wrong helper. Like, amazingly not at all appropriate helper. So we're gonna get a different power or something. Or. Er, hmm. What abilities are even good underwater here? I think I just want Kine. Where can I get Kine? No, I didn't want to go here. Um, 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 um. I can get Kine here, right? There's kind. Alright. Though, in Smash 4, I honestly wouldn't expect too many awesome balance improvements, because I mean, well, actually since Namco is involved, I mean, maybe it will be more balanced. I don't know. It's just, balance has never seemed to be one of Smash's priorities. And I mean... Especially since large amounts of the game are, you know, due to randomness, like, you know, the items, uh, levels like Mute City and such. I mean, I wish they would make it more balanced. But I wouldn't hold your breath. Anchor. This guy eats a lot of anchors. Also human skulls. And possibly humans. Dang it. I hate when he does that. He does that a lot. Like, he'll spit an item out right in front of him. The item that you spit out. There you go. <laughs> also, I forgot he explodes. This is definitely not the end of the game. This is the end of the second world. Forgot this one, they don't turn friendly. You just defeat them and then heart stars happen. Alright. Have we seen Acro in any of the other games? Pokemon Conquest. I'm not even familiar with the, what that is. <laughs> the cutscenes in this are great. <clears throat> I love the innocent look. Alright, he was on Kirby 64. But, I mean, that makes sense. Kirby 64 is, like, largely a remake. Well, story-wise, it's a remake of Dreamland 3. Because it's got the, uh... Wait. This is the mushroom one. We want to kill those flowers. Because, I mean, it's got the whoa. Yeah, in this one, we want to kill the flowers and not the mushrooms. Because we're evil. Like, Kirby 64, it doesn't share much of the gameplay similarity, but it shares the dark matter plotline. No, I told you to... Okay. Kine? That's not the...
bunny does something. I forget what, though. Oh, wait, it tells you... Doesn't it show you where to go into a place? Right. I don't need you, Kirby bunny. I remember things. I'm going to get a pet and then immediately die. Because I have no health. Uh, let's go with the pitch. I guess it doesn't matter. I don't need a pet for this area. There are various levels where, you, where you'll need a pet or an ability or both to get your crap heart star. This is not one of them. Also, I love little touches like this thing. This little, you know, you can bump it and it sways back and forth. Back in the Super Nintendo days, like, just little inconsequential stuff like that was just amazing. Like, back then it was on the same level as, you know, impressive dog physics are in the new Call of Duty. You know, this is our impressive dog physics. You know? The new Call of Duty has, like, an entire CPU dedicated to dog physics, but back then we had, you know, little dandelions that could blow away. And, honestly, I preferred the little dandelions that could blow away to dog physics. I don't think we need dog physics. Ah, there it is. Like, certain projectiles he'll block back, but not other... Well, I think pretty much any projectile, but this, you know, spark isn't considered a projectile. I was having trouble speaking that. Happy Mushroom! I love how we kill all of the flowers to please the mushroom, and that's, you know, we just kind of go with that, because, I mean, you know, whatever. Whatever you need to. What you need, whatever you gotta do, man. Nice. Sleepy dude! What do I need for sleepy dude? This was no. This is is this a mini game? Do, 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 do. Wait, is this game before Superstar? I f I'm forgetting my chronology now. Is this before or after Kirby Superstar? Like, yeah, Gourmet, Gourmet Race, one of the best Kirby songs. 
I mean, it's based on um, the best Kirby song, um, DDD's theme. DDD may be an incredibly incompetent villain, but he has the best freaking boss theme ever. How about that? I played this game how many times? Yeah, Mass DDD has his, the Mass DD theme is just so badass. Really, most of the remixes on Kirby Superstar Ultra are awesome. They always have really good remixes, um, and so does Brawl. I'm really looking forward to the new Brawl themes. Like, I would buy that game just for. Um, the Wily's theme remix in that, in the trailer. Like, I absolutely need the full version of that Wily's theme from, um, if you haven't seen it, the new Brawl trailer. It has like 30 seconds of a remix from Wily stage theme from Mega Man 2, and it is the best shit ever. How dare you not have played a Kirby game? I think that is illegal in most states. Oh right, you clean things! Okay, okay, I remember this. I just need broom. Galactonite in that? Is, Kirk, is he in Kirby's Return to Dreamland? I, I mean, I played the normal game. I haven't finished the extra game. You didn't even fight Meta Knight, did you? Wait, I do plan to stream um, Kirby's Return to Dreamland for extra mode, but um, since I had the audio desync, I've got two problems, um, and neither of them are regexes. Um, I'm sorry, buddy. Um, shit, I knew that was going to be bad. Um... But yeah, since I've started to try and stream, or, um, encode that stream, or, you know, upload it to YouTube, I found that the audio is decode, or desynced, and so, no, I needed that, damn it. So, like, I need to, 
I need to find some way to stream without it desyncing the audio. And secondly, I need some way to hopefully unscrew up the audio. Like, it's not major desync, it's like maybe one second it's very worst. And I'm trying to get it to, you know, something fairly reasonable, but it's just... I've got to dick around with the audio sync for four separate sessions and like seven hours of video, and it's incredibly unpleasant. Speaking of, have you guys... are you guys noticing any audio desync? Like... Or do the sound effects, like, perfectly match up with the visuals? Like, I want to know immediately if something like that, like, isn't synced. You know what's weird? Um, if Camtasia drops a ton of frames, it can desync, but... When I'm streaming, I drop almost no frames, so I really don't know why it gradually desyncs. Ow. Like, they, I mean, considering, it's pretty decent, considering they're doing, you know, live video to shit tons of people, but it's kind of buggy in assorted ways. Though I was really surprised and disappointed how crappy the YouTube streaming went. I tried that out once. It was, wow. I was so incredibly excited that I could finally stream on YouTube, you know, with all of my 4,000 subscribers on there and all the cool features YouTube has, but then I actually stream, the quality is crap, people are getting stuck on the past versions of the video, the comments are like a minute behind. It was... it was just bad. I hope they improve it, but for now I just gotta go with Twitch. Speaking of Twitch, I'm kind of disappointed the PS4 is going to be streaming to Ustream. Uh, it won't affect me because I have my own capture equipment anyway, so... Um, I might test the Ustreaming just to see how well the PS4 streams. But I'll continue to use Twitch TV and I'll just continue to use my own streaming hardware when I get my PS4. Which I've already pre-ordered. Um, I generally get the Sony and Nintendo consoles no matter what, and this generation has given me particularly much reason to believe the Sony console will be superior to the Microsoft one, so... M tomato good! Yes! Need. Eat. Alright. Not to get too... Not to, you know wax on the consoles too much. I was thinking of doing a podcast sort of thing where I discuss various gaming issues and I was thinking of doing one with the Xbox One and PS4 and all that crap. Or just E3 in general, I guess. Uh, see you, Shade.